this is the radio. This is it. This is the one I'm most excited about for 2025. Stick around and we'll get right to it. Hey guys, welcome back. Jason, KM4ACK, coming from Hamcation 2025. And I am super stoked about this Kenwood 750 that's gonna be coming out. And I've got to bug Don a little bit this morning and try to get something that the rest of us don't know quite yet. It's gonna be hard, isn't it, Don? It's gonna be hard. <laughs> Thank you but so you, much but, for but taking But you do me. know me. You do know me. If, if it's true, I will tell you. That, that's absolutely true. All right. So tell me what you can about the radio that's coming out. Okay. Uh, it's going to be D-Star. It's going to be uh, tri-band, 220, 440, 2 meters. Um, let's just say APRS, um, built-in wireless LAN network can be accessed directly and easily using the direct mode. Not sure what that means. A uh, little wordy there, but some something to where you can have connectivity without RF. Okay. Um, right. uh, let's see. Um, let's see. Built-in TNC kiss. The way it's explained to me is if you take a, a, a D75 and a uh, the 710 mobile radio, merge them together. That's kind of what you're going to get. Yeah. The, the kind of capabilities. Okay. Plus some others. So are we gonna have access to the TNC? I believe so. You believe so? I believe so. All right. There is two, there are two, each, the, both the body and the head have a USB-C port. They also have a SD card, S, mini, uh, mini micro SD card, and that's more of a speculation, but I think that's where you can access the TNC. There is, there appears to be no, um, like data cables, so, when I say that, the conventional stuff from 20 years ago. Right. I believe, I think it's going to be from USB. -C. You think USB C to the computer that, is going right. to do it? That's right. Well, that's possible with the D75. That's correct. Yeah. yeah so, very, very similar. At okay. Least, I, at least that, that, it's not definitive, but <laughs> that's, again, you know. Um, I'm also seeing Bluetooth. It's going to be Bluetooth. Don't know what versions of Bluetooth. Okay. So, All right. so I don't know that I don't know the versions of Bluetooth. Um, that's that's all I can say about that because. <laughs> well, I like the Bluetooth because I actually use a Linux computer, Bluetooth to this to get access to the TNC yep. with the D seventy five. Yes, I, I suspect it's going to be very similar. You know, okay. I mean, I would say a lot of engineering out of the seventy five will be put in here. Okay. All right. Time frame. You're going to have this to us by Dayton, right? Um, don't know that one for sure. <laughs> but what I can tell you is, is somewhere on one of the flyers it says something about it. It'll be this year. I can tell you that. It's going to be this year. Yep. And uh, we may have a prototype at Dayton. Well, you had a prototype of the D75 at Dayton, but we couldn't touch it. That's right. <laughs> so that doesn't so, count, Don. Well, you know, it, it's going to be more than a mock-up. Let's, okay. let's put it that way. All right. So, yeah, what we're seeing here uh, in Hamcation, that's just a mock-up. It's just a mock-up. And, you know, there's, there's like the back of the radio, there's no connections on the back of the radio. We don't show that because there's, there isn't, there's no heat sink because there, that's just, it's just a mock-up. So, okay. Anyway. But, but we feel it's going to be close. It'll be the, very close to this. Okay. Fantastic. All right. The, the, the new thing is it'll have a speaker in the front. Speaker in the front, uh, dual watt, dual uh, VFO. It'll be it'll, and the hookups will be very similar to the to the 710. So the uh, microphone will be on the body. On it. So, so that was a speculation I made after the Tokyo Ham Fair of the first yeah. time I saw it. Yeah. And I thought it was going to be able to plug the the mic into yeah. the head, but as far that's as not I, the far, case. as far as I again, it's all subject to change. Okay. All right. Okay. So from the mock-up, there's a plug-in for the microphone. And then a, the panel mount. So like, like the 710, you'll have the uh, RT system somewhere under the seat up to the control head. Okay, so it's just going to be a separation cable, basically, yeah. to the control head, but the microphone still plugs into the body. That, right. At least that's a speculation. That's a speculation, <laughs> but most likely, most likely that's the way it's going to be. Um, uh, I, I know you're going to ask about duplexer, so I'm just going to answer that for you. I don't know. I was getting there. <laughs> when, I was getting there. Full I, I, duplex? I don't know that. All right. Okay. They're they're monitoring, you know, so they they monitoring what we what we say, and so hopefully that hopefully you'll get duplex. If we do do, do, do get 
get duplex. Um, I think it's going to be like two meters and 440. Okay. All right. Because uh, adding 220 may be two, just an expense that's not really used. Okay. All right. But it is D Star. It is D Star and uh, probably going to have terminal mode. So it's going to be kind of like that. So basically, we're looking at the mobile version of the D75. That's right. And a 710 put together and other stuff. Because all we hear is you're gonna you're gonna like you're gonna like you're gonna like this you're gonna like this. Did you Peter built in? I, I would imagine so. Okay, because that's one of the cool features I, about the D75. I, I I don't see why it, it, it would not be there. Okay, good. Again, I can't. That's not a definitive <laughs> yes, but it would just make sense. Right, Don. Thank you so all much right, for no taking worries, a few no minutes worries, with no us worries. this morning. Guys, if you found today's information helpful, be sure to give us a thumbs up before you head off. We will see you on the next one. Until then, 7-3.